Now, when it comes to social media platforms, free speech and also the spread of misinformation and fake news, believe it or not, are divided by an extremely a thin line. Many fail to understand the difference, and sometimes even the social media platforms themselves have no clue as to what are facts and what is essentially fake news. And this is a controversy in which Twitter now seems to be mired in. The social media giant's latest move has sparked a massive storm. Believe it or not, this is what Twitter has done. The Twitter account of a leading U.S. virologist, Dr. Robert Malone, has now been suspended by Twitter. But who is Dr. Robert Malone? Now, Robert Malone happens to be the inventor of the mRNA technology that is being used to vaccinate millions of people around the world. So we're talking about a researcher who has come up with the mRNA technology of making vaccines. But believe it or not, Twitter, Twitter, in its wisdom, has decided to suspend the account of a scientist who's come up with the mRNA vaccine, and it claims it has done this because he was allegedly spreading misinformation on COVID-19 vaccines. Let that sink in. The person who came up with an mRNA vaccine, his Twitter account has been suspended by Twitter because they claim he was spreading fake news. Now, Dr. Malone had over 500,000 followers on Twitter. He was removed after he shared a video about supposed harmful effects of the Pfizer jab. In a tweet, Dr. Malone has noted that Pfizer's six-month data shows that its COVID vaccine causes more illness than it prevents. He also has pointed out the flaws in Pfizer's trial, both in design and also in execution. In a video, he explained that the harms feared to be coming from the Pfizer mRNA vaccine for COVID-19. Twitter so far has not commented on the move. Despite being involved with the development of the mRNA, Dr. Malone has become an outspoken critic of mass vaccination. Both the Pfizer and the Moderna jabs are built on mRNA technology, which uses genetic engineering to create antibodies. Now, Dr. Malone, however, has said that there is not enough testing in place to warrant for mass vaccinations at this point of time. The sudden suspension of Dr. Malone's account has also raised some serious doubts on Twitter's authority and even credibility. Does Twitter have enough experts with it who can actually suspend a Twitter account of a leading scientist, someone who is involved in the development of the mRNA vaccine? Now, Dr. Malone's followers have slammed the social media website for so silencing the voice of a top scientist and a doctor without checking facts. Now, the big question, of course, is this. What competence has Twitter got to ban a leading scientist and also the inventor of the mRNA technology? And is Twitter's move an attempt to block concerns regarding the safety of vaccines? Did Twitter conduct a fact check before suspending Dr. Malone's account? These are some questions that Twitter will do well to answer. Beyond is now available in your country. Download the app now and get all the news on the move.